Hi, Bellas! My name is Valerie Tan. I'm going to the mall in a bit, so join me as I get ready. First step, my face is bare but I'm wearing colored contact lens. It's fresh look in gemstone green. Uh, kung isipin mo green parang ano siya, parang siyang napaka wild na color for someone like me na Asian na Chinese. But it actually works kasi very natural yung pagka green niya. So mukha lang buhay yung mata ko which helps kasi chinita ko. Okay, after the colored contact lens, I'm going to put this um, Max Factor Smooth Miracle Primer. A primer is something that a lot of Filipinas skip out on, but it's very important. Because itong primer it helps the makeup last. Tapos uh, nag nagiging even yung balat. So kung baga uh, nagbumuka siyang poreless, flawless, and then pag nagapply kay ng makeup, uh, mas mabilis i apply yung liquid foundation or powder. So after applying. My primer next is itong Makeup Forever Pro Sculpting Palette. Ah, uh, dati kasi hindi rin ako masyado nagsa-sculpt ng face. I just usually put on blush, but I realized how important uh, contouring is kasi round yung mukha ko. So, minsan kailangan natin lagyan ng cheekbones para kunyari ano, parang Caucasian ganyan, 'di ba? Tisay, may may cheekbones ang content. Ayun. Nilalagyan ko dito. So, medyo nagsa-suck ako ng face brush mm -hmm. the side of the forehead and on the other side of my face yeah. so makita niyo harsh yung pagkalagay ko ng contour hindi yan ganyan ang kailangan is to blend siya with a sponge using a sponge this one, which I obviously haven't cleaned. <laughs> Ito, blend natin siya ng maigi. Yung trick kasi sa concealing is to be able to blend it para hindi halatang may harsh edges, may harsh line. Hindi halatang nag-contour. Parang ano lang siya dapat, shadow lang siya dapat sa face. Ayan. So kung may contour, syempre kailangan meron ding highlight ng face. Ang maganda dito sa Pro Sculpting Palette, meron siya yung mga pang highlight na mukha. Ayan. Gagamitin natin itong medyo gold glittery shade. This one I will put on my cheekbones. Okay, I'll use the other side of the sponge. Dito. Lalagay natin siya. Ayan. Ayan. Para medyo goldish yung effect. Dewy. And na-highlight yung cheekbones. Tapos middle of the forehead. And then, syempre, nose bridge. Para mukhang matangos. Okay. After that, uh, under eye concealer ang kailangan ko because I have huge, hindi naman siya huge, pero very dark under eye circle. Whether matulog ako 8 hours or 4 hours, it's always there because it's genetic. So, kailangan natin ito, this one, a salmon color. Which is good to good for covering yung mga under eye circles. So using my fingertip, yun, my ring finger, gently dab dito sa under eye circle. Usually nilalagyan ko lang ng color is yung yung eto eh, yung parang yung half moon shape ng eye bags ko. Yun lang nilalagyan ko. Tapos konting konti lang kasi ayoko naman magmukhang orange yung face ko. Other side. Ayan. Okay. Afterwards, I use the Max Factor Miracle Touch in Sand Color. This one. And then, I cover yung under eye concealer. Na under eye uh, corrector pala. Using the concealer, I cover the under eye corrector. Dabit din. Ayoko rin maglagay ng sobrang daming concealer kasi pag sobrang dami, sometimes instead of covering the flaws, you're actually emphasizing it more. Ayan. Other people use brushes when applying concealer. Ako, I like using my fingers. 
kasi mas nakokontrol ko yung yung intensity ng pagdab. Little bit more. Ayan. So ngayon, I feel na medyo uh, clean na yung palette in a way na na-cover ko na yung under eye circle and then medyo na-contour ko na. But what I need now is to make it more um, even by using a loose powder from Eliana. It's a mineral loose powder. Uh, actually, gusto ko mga mineral loose powder because it has no talc. Uh, so it's safer for the skin. So using a big brush, okay, tap away and then spread the face. Pag may events ako, naglalagay ako ng mga liquid foundation. But since ano lang naman to, going to the mall, very light lang, cutting contour, and then loose powder. Yan, para magpantay lang yung color ng face. Let me see. Okay. Yan. Okay, ready na tayo sa face. Now, let's move on to, to the eyes. Since it's just going to the mall, I won't be putting on eyeshadow anymore. I'll go straight to the eyeliner. This is the uh, Brow House Precision Eyeliner in color brown. Uh, if you're if you're having difficulty choosing between black or brown eyeliner, uh, here's a tip. Uh, kung day, day, uh, daytime wear siya, better stick to brown or gray para naman uh, it doesn't look too harsh. So, brown eyeliner on the upper lash line. Usually, ang ginagawa ko, nilalagay ko siya mismo sa lash line. Para hindi halata may eyeliner. Other side. Ayan. And since my eyes are a little bit droopy, nilalagyan ko siya ng small wing dito sa outer part para, mag, para ma-lift yung mata ko para mukhang hindi siya droopy. Pero small wing lang kasi kung medyo malaki yung wing, parang medyo pang night time na yun. So kung daytime wear, small wing. If you're scared kung hindi na hindi magpantay yung wing eyeliner nyo, there are tricks for it. You can use like a uh, scotch tape. Lalagyan nyo siya dito para magpantay. Parang meron kayong guide. Or you can use mga calling cards or iba't ibang card. Basta matigas na cardboard. Basta nandiyan lang siya sa side. Para pag ginawa niyo yung wing, uh, may guide kayo para magpantay siya. But since I do it all the time, medyo napapantay ko naman na yung wing liner ko. Okay, next is to curl my lashes. And I have a trick here. Uh, other people, they choose to blow dry itong pad para mag-heat mag yung pad tapos mas mabalis mag-curl ng lashes. But since parang I feel like it's an extra step na mag-blow dry pa ako ng curler, ginagawa ko, nilarub ko na lang siya using my fingers. Ganyan. Like a few seconds lang para there's heat on the pad. And when I curl my lashes, mas, mas mabilis siyang sumusunod. Ayan. Nag-curl na agad yung lashes ko. Usually kasi very stubborn yung lashes ko. Talagang lashes ko nakabagsak siyang ganyan. Other people kasi medyo parang 90 degree angle pa eh. But mine talagang as in downwards. So I need to press harder. Para lang ma-curl up siya. Ayan. And then another round. Just to make sure talagang curl na curl siya. Yan, ready. Okay. Next, I use a uh, Revlon mascara, na yung volume and length uh, version niya. Yan. What I do is I use the tip. Hindi ko siya kinakurl ng paganito eh. I use the tip and then zigzag motion upwards. It works for me because it makes my lashes look longer. Kasi nga, may seeing lashes ko. And then I try to uh, separate the lashes para hindi siya mukhang spider. Spider legs, I mean. Yan. Next is the tattoo. 
tattoo eyebrow. So since I had my eyebrow tattooed a few years ago, uh, medyo low maintenance na siya. So gumagamit na lang ako nitong Revlon uh, Brow Fantasy uh, kit, eyebrow kit nila just to fill in the sparse areas or yung mga empty areas ng eyebrow ko kasi uh, nung natattoo siya a few years ago, syempre medyo nafe-fade na siya. So may mga areas na may butas. So kailangan ko lang siyang i-cover. Ayan. And using the color wand, brush lang siya. Hmm. What I also do is, um, to make my eyes look bigger or larger, itong eyeliner that I used a while ago from upper lash line, naglalagay lang ako ng konti sa lower lash line ko para mas mukhang buhay lang. Okay. Next is applying a uh, blush. I'm again using Revlon, one of my favorite local brands. International brands rather, pero sikat na dito locally. This is Revlon Blush in Orchid Charm. Smile. And I top it off with, uh, again, Revlon Ultra HD uh, Lip Color. This is in intensity, so uh, bright pink siya, na matte. Since uso-uso yung matte ngayon. Hmm, yan! Buhay na yung mukha ko. A while ago, it, it looked pale and medyo, syempre, eye bags and everything. Pero ngayon, uh, mas polish na siya. So I'm ready to go to the mall. Ito yung look ko for the mall, okay? Uh, for a makeup addict, um, it is already considered light makeup. <laughs> and for my hair, uh, what I usually do is um, for lazy days like uh, going to the mall or lazy Sundays, uh, I tie it in a bun because it kind of looks chic din naman yung mga bun or half half bun. So parang ganito, tie ko lang siya sa taas lang, parang half lang, half pony. So medyo may pagka-Korean look yung dating niya. And that's a very easy to do lang. So if I have no time or if I'm too lazy to curl my hair or to blow dry my hair, this is what I do. So I tie it in a half, half bun. Yan. Tapos, ganyan yung medyo inaayos ko yung hair ko dito sa baba. And then I wear a really nice jacket or a denim jacket and then Parang yun na, very casual lang, but I still look like I made time to uh, make myself look good. So, yun. This is my Lazy Sunday uh, makeup. So, thank you so much for getting ready with me, Bellas, and I'll see you soon. Bye!